to for police report documenting. Welcome back. It's the beginning of another vlog. I am, it's a Friday today. Got a bit of conditioner in here, so that it's why, that it's why my head is wrapped up. I'm on my way over to get my nails done. It's been a hot minute. Uh, it's close to a month, actually. And the reason why is because one, I've been so busy, but also two, they haven't broken off yet. So I was just like, okay. I mean, they're growing out, but they haven't broken off, and I suppose that's a good thing, right? So I can keep them on for a little bit longer. 
um but it has been so busy and i haven't had a chance to chat with you guys and i thought this would be the perfect opportunity to actually talk about some of the things that have happened that i haven't really spoken much about in my previous vlogs because i'm trying to make my vlogs a little bit more uh watch instead of talk 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 all the time make them more visual than too much dialogue you know i didn't want to have too much dialogue in my vlogs so okay okay thank you i'm not quite sure what's happening um so uh this week was an amazing week and i will share with you guys you probably must have seen it by now or I will share it with you guys. One of the gigs that I got was a Momentum Multiply gig. And the reason why, and I say gig because like campaign, it this didn't feel like a campaign. It felt like, because I was called in to interview the head of Momentum Multiply and um, I had to interview a neurologist. It was just insane because the whole point of Momentum Multiply was to speak more about Momentum Multiply itself, but to also talk about how it focuses and harnesses uh, mental health. It looks and zeroes in on mental health and not just physical wellness, so all types of wellness. And I loved that, more especially mental health. And I thought that was freaking phenomenal. So for me, I think that uh, I just absolutely loved it, but I was really, really stressed out about it because I had to do a lot of reading up on the people that I was going to be interviewing. And we were talking about mental health and technology in the digital age and how, you know, the, the information overload and the excessive use of technology, social media impacts our mental health. And I was, and I was interviewing these people who are all within their right very very much educated and well adversed in their fields and for me that was scary is this better yeah maybe it's better i don't know i'm wearing my bonner by wednesdays okay so if anybody gonna ask it's the bonner by wednesdays but that's the kind of week that i was having right and there's another campaign that i've secured and i'm i'm just I'm filled with a lot of gratitude, but also at the same time, I'm filled with a lot of appreciation, you know, a lot of appreciation for what's been happening. You know, I feel like there's a huge cloud that is lifting off of my mental space, off of my emotional space. Um, I feel really, really really i hate it when the sun streams in like this but it'd be like that sometimes you know what i'm saying um i feel a huge lift i feel good i feel secure in myself i feel like it's okay you know for the first time in a really long time i feel like you know what it's all right it's all right i'm good i'm good um and it's because i i've just gotten to that point where I am I'm choosing myself do you know what I mean I'm choosing myself and I'm choosing to say you know what it's okay you know it's okay uh, let me see I still have like two minutes or so to talk to you guys but I feel like it's it's okay and I'm grateful I'm happy um, I just feel like there's this huge cloud that's just lifted lifted off of me and I'm so the momentum gig for me was really, really solid. And I feel is a great stepping stone to the dreams and goals that I have for myself. One of the big dreams and goals, which I can share, and I don't mind sharing, was to be able to go into spaces like this, you know, big corporate spaces and speak about mental health. Do you know that one in three people in this country are depressed? One in three. So for the mere fact that Momentum Multiply focuses a lot as well on mental health, 
is something that I'm very, very proud to say that they onboarded me for this particular day. So it was happening at the Mark, at the Momentum offices. And then after that, I went out for drinks with Theo, my videographer. I'll put up a picture of Theo here, if I can find it. He hardly ever puts any pictures of himself online. So I don't know. But Theo shot the content and he actually sent me the content this morning, the reels and the videos. And I was just like, oh my God, it's so good. <laughs> I'm very happy. I'm very happy because I'm... I'm 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 driven, I'm focused, I am pushing out content and work and I am literally unstoppable at this point and I'm okay with whatever comes my way. I'm going out, I'm spending time with people, I'm going to lunches, I'm kikiing. It's lovely. It's lovely. I'm I'm just choosing myself. I went through a very difficult time of uh questioning myself feeling hurt feeling tired drained disrespected i really went through a really difficult time uh feeling alone and unseen and it was just like but now my babe <laughs> who am i <laughs> anyway let me go get my nails done i'll talk to you guys a little bit later i'm 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 at that point where I feel like it's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. I'm going to be present. I'm going to show up for the things and the people that show up for me. And everything else is just noise at this point. And it's all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Bad little flex, she wanna know me I stay low-key, all gas, no brakes Baby, let them hoes sleep Body on 10, make your girl OD I get in my way, never out of my lane Feel like you the one and I'm on one So what it's gonna be? Baby squad up, we finna go deep Riding on a team, got what you need Baby, won't you keep me company? So one of the things that I love to do is go out and watch movies lately. And on this day, I was coming back from work and I thought to myself, you know what? Let me just pop in, watch a movie. Eventually got home, came into the house with some groceries, got changed and tuck into the groceries. Either way, that's not what I'm trying to talk to you guys about. You guys can have a look at the grocery situation. It's fine. I needed a coffee. Yeah, I need one now. <laughs> but you guys said you like the voiceovers as opposed to just me being silent. I don't know what it is about my voice that you like because I don't like it. Either way, whatever, man. So on this week, I was just feeling very, very overwhelmed with all the work that I had to do. I felt tired. I felt very overstimulated. There was just a lot going on. And for someone like me, who's an introvert, I really struggled with a lot of stuff happening. That's why I don't like to talk. Often, a lot of the time, I'll just be like, no, I just, I just want to listen to my audiobook chair. I just want to enjoy and I'm actually reading. I think you guys don't even think that I'm reading. I'm just reading really slowly. Like right now I'm I'm reading um what's that? Cleopatra and Frankenstein by Coco Mellers and it's it's ah, I'm going to be dropping a review on it on Instagram very soon. But either way, I just have been experiencing so much great things but at the same time feeling a heart of gratitude and quiet you know I spent all of June just so busy in out in out and I know that I'll be traveling in July I did tell you guys that uh, I wanted to travel in June but then I got too 
uh, work gigs and I've been getting more clients and things like that. I just couldn't do June. So I had to move my trip. But I am going to be doing a little solo location. Yes, 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 queen. Yes, I need one. So I'm going to be doing one in July. And I love to travel when it's cold. So I don't have a problem. I don't have a problem. I am going to do that and reward myself probably at the end of July. We'll see how it goes. Just a little a little shot left. You hear my chat? A little shot left. But uh, for now, I just work, you know? I have been enjoying going out, meeting new people. <laughs> I've met a number of new people, okay? <laughs> We're going to talk about that. What day is what day? I'll talk about it. But, you know, sometimes, let me just... Shuck, shuck. I'm playing my cards really tightly close to my chest. I don't want to... I don't want to speak as yet, but outside of that, it's been a good time. This vlog is going to be a little on the shorter end, but it's okay. Next week's vlog will be a little bit longer. The other week will be a little bit shorter. It's fine. It doesn't matter. Um, I just wanted to test out the voiceover situation, and I want you guys to let me know in the comments below what do you think. Side note, I hate winter. The amount of times I will get my coats and then put them in the car. What drop? Ooh, eh. So nevertheless, the week is ending and we're beginning a new week. And I just wanted to come on here to say, look forward to your days. Look forward to the good days, the bad days. And often when you have bad days, they prepare you for really great days days there's so much that i wish to share with you guys with a girl on girl talk <laughs> i want to talk to you guys about some that's been happening but i don't want to share it on the main space you know what i'm saying anyway so um have a good week i will be back with a longer vlog next week and i'm so 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 excited to share with you everything that's going on but until then watch me have a light dinner, well, light for me, chair, but a dinner with my family, and I'll see you in the next vlog. Hey, Kanya, hey, girl. Ah, those are my two lovely sisters. I think you guys know, but we were having a girly date night out without our dad, and it was so great. It's always a good time. So anyway, I'm gonna wrap up the vlog here. I'll see you in the next one very, very soon. Okay, bye.